Philadelphia is the birthplace of our nation. We got the Liberty Bell, we got Betsy Ross's house, we got everything, we got William Penn. And then we got South Philadelphia, where I was born and raised. So you can take all that good government bullshit and throw it out the window. Now you're dealing with the streets of South Philadelphia. It was probably the greatest mob town in the country during the 80s. People were getting killed day after day. They were finding bodies everywhere. Jimmy Broom's Diodorio got whacked right up here on the corner. Right over there on the left, he was coming out of the club and he got whacked. My name is Angelo Lutz. I'm a chef, or better yet, I'm a cook. I was born and raised in South Philadelphia. And I grew up in the streets, you know? I went out, I, I worked legitimately, and I worked illegitimately. I hustled. Whatever I had to do to put a dollar in my pocket. Angelo was charged with racketeering, along with Joey Merlino and five other co-defendants. Racketeering involved bookmaking, loan sharking, extortion. Angelo got a harsher sentence than probably was warranted because he was always in the news during the trial, and I think it pissed the feds off and it pissed the judge off. I cooked for everybody, from John Franzese, known as Sonny Franzese, to the lowliest guys you ever met in your life. When I got out of prison, no one wanted to help me, so I decided to open my own restaurant. And here I am today at the Kitchen Consigliere Cafe in Collinswood, New Jersey. I'm still gambling, only this time I'm gambling on myself. I got a great staff of people but everyone has their own agenda. Let's get him out of here first, and then we'll work on this other ticket. I got Joe Squirrel, he's my host. Hey, How are you doing? Let me, let me do the I want to be the manager, be yeah, the manager. Yeah. I got Karen, she's my manager. Just upsell, 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 upsell. I'll take it to court, his assets will be your assets. And then I got Marty, he's my business manager. He's also known as the complaint department, and he handles all the bullshit I don't want to handle. Another Jamelli I've met people from New York. New Jersey, I've met people from all over the place. Those people who have come in, they treat me well. When I say those people, I mean mobsters. We're here at JNA Culinary School. South Philadelphia. I also have an internet cooking show which could be seen via Philly.com, which I do with Marty Hall. That's called Cooking with the Kitchen Consigliere. I don't want to go back to jail. I don't want to go back to the old ways. I just feel that I can make it. I, I need my money. I got wolves at the door every day here because of what happened in the past. Every day is a struggle. I don't know how I'm going to pay the bills in here, but I just do. This is this is the lot. This, this is, what is we're going looking to be at. it, baby. We're going to have the French doors over here. Yeah. We're going to have seating on this side. Try to get this done, that done. Go get pasta. You want sausage? It's all about deadline. You got to focus a little bit. Business was bad, fuck you, pay me. Stay away from the casinos are a bad apple. I'm going through the door and I'm not going to leave until you write me my check. Well, I can't deal with the personality today. Okay, that's it. You're an asshole, you know that? If he goes back to his old way of life, I will personally kick his ass. Take the fucking milk and put the chocolate syrup in it that we use for the desserts. I mean, what's the fucking difference? I mean, it's Brain chocolate milk. Man, they're so fucking stupid in that restaurant.